My parents divorced when I was very young. It was pretty much my mom raising four boys, so my mom was gone, waiting tables late nights. Uh, we'd get home from school, and then right when we were getting home from school, she'd be leaving at 4, 4 p.m. and, you know, working until midnight sometimes. I think being a middle child, I think I longed for a lot of things that I wasn't getting at home. I just wanted, I wanted to be noticed, I wanted to be seen, and I, and I figured, man, if I could be successful in music, doing something that I love, I mean, man, it would fill all my voids and all those desires that I longed for when I was a kid. I thought the next venture, or the next city, or the next woman, or, or just the next anything, and I even remember in 2013, one of my most successful years in my music career, Great Night, just won five awards. And I remember just sitting at the bar and I'm just like, I don't even wanna be here. Uh, my mom gave me a book, The Purpose Driven Life by Rick Warren. And it mentioned how we weren't made for earth, we were built for heaven and eternity. And that's why, you know, our hearts are always longing for something that this earth or world will never satisfy. This is the answer I've been looking for my whole life. Nothing under the sun will satisfy me, and I know that. I know that now. So I started um, going to celebrate recovery about a year and a half ago. Um, when I finally realized, or I decided to address um, uh, my, my sex addiction, no matter how, you know, how, how much you messed up or, or what you've done, like they, they welcome you with open arms. You know, I was, I was glorifying things like, um, you know, women and drinking and all this other kind of stuff. I've tried filling voids with sex for almost 20 years of my life. After 20 years, still nothing. Now my music is more faith-based and I, and I really enjoy honoring Christ with my music because it's like, it's one of those things like, what would you do if you, if you found a cure for AIDS or you found a cure for cancer or something like that and you knew you could, you could, you could like cure millions of people across the world? What would you want to do? You want to share with the world, right? You'd want to like scream out loud and tell everybody, hey, I got the cure, you know what I mean? I want to share with the world the cure for my for my depression, for, for those voids, for, for all those things that I longed for when I was a kid. And the best way I know how to do that is with my talents, with what God gave me, my, my, my passion, my talents for music and filmmaking. That's why my new album, I'm, I'm honoring and glorifying God. Um, I'm trying to share with the world how loving and forgiving He is and how graceful He is and how merciful He is and hopefully bring more people to Him with my music.